It's critical to our business, you know, and it always has been. It's an amazing event. It's by far Australia's best boat show by a country mile. Yeah. The, uh, you know, the organisers do a fantastic job here. I think, you know, you can just see around that the place is alive. There's been a lot of people here. The industry looks fantastic. All the brands look fantastic. I mean, you know, it, it's a wonderful show. And I think, um, you know, Century Cove should be very proud of what they put on here. And, and I think that, you know, the industry really relies on them big time to put this together, to, to get together and, 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 and show our stuff. So, yeah, we're very grateful for this show and, um, and, and happy to be part of it. The boats really stand out. They call the Palm Beach the, the yachtsman's power boat. Just, just uh, tell us, Mark, um, I mean, this, this is sort of all of your ocean racing experience converging and your knowledge converging in these boats. It must be pretty special to sit on the boat now and, and sort of look at what you've created. I'm obviously very passionate about what I do, you know, and it's um, whether it's sailing wild oats or building Palm Beach motor yachts and, and Grand Banks today, you know, so it's... Uh, but look, I'm, you know, we're very driven by performance and efficiencies. It's just something we do, obviously, from you know, yacht racing and you know, transferring that into power boating is a really big deal for us. And um, you know, today we have a product here today, you know, 70 foot boat that's using you know, 50 to 70 percent less fuel than any other boat in the world for the same speed. So mm -hmm. it's a very satisfying thing that we've been doing and um, you know, really, really enjoy it. And um, we're really proud of the results. That connection with sailing and the knowledge that you pick up seamanship and so forth and the hydrodynamics there is a marriage there, isn't there? Yeah, look, ab absolutely. And I think, you know, my, my sailing background, you know, I come from the America's Cup background, very high tech, you know, construction techniques. So um, obviously these boats today, all of our boats are very highly uh, geared with carbon fiber. And we work very hard at, you know, high strength and low weight. So, and all those things, you know, just obviously improve efficiencies, with, you know, um, to a whole new level. So mm -hmm. that's what we specialize in. It's something we really focus hard on. And, um, you know, I'm pretty confident we're the only boat building company in the world, you know, power boat building company in the world that's building boats to this level from a composite structure perspective. And that's why we're seeing the amazing performance. But, um, you know, it's not just amazing in performance, it's seagoing capabilities. There's so many great attributes that come out of what we've uh, put into the design from our sailing, you know, sailing backgrounds. It's a, it's an internationally recognised brand now. I mean, you've got a significant presence in the US. It's not bad going for, a, for an Australian company. <laughs> for an Aussie battler, you mean. It's a, <laughs> look, it's, yeah, once again, I'm very proud of what we've achieved. I mean, I have a fantastic team, you know, with me as well. Obviously, you can't do this by yourself, but it's, um, yeah, look, Palm Beach Motors is becoming you know, very well known in America. It's been you know, 25 years of uh, hard work, obviously, but it's really starting to pay off. And like anything, you know, we, we focus very highly on performance and quality and, mm -hmm. and customer experience and service and all those things that go with it. So with our clientele base, we, you know, we, we're very highly customised boats. So we get a lot of great ideas from so many different customers and mm -hmm. all those great ideas are morphing into one product. So that's been the fun thing about where we are today is it's not just me, it's, it's all of our customers' knowledge and what have you is just morphing into a very generically good product. And um, there's a lot of work involved with all that stuff, but um, it's really starting to pay off. And yeah, it's, um, I'm looking forward to see what the next five years does. And from those early boats, Mark, the 30 and 40 footers that you built early on, and you've scaled, I guess, that same principle with the V-warp hull and, and the boats that you've created now. And you know, where do you see the range going? Are you sort of happy with the size range? No, I'm not happy. <laughs> I mean, look, the big thing is, um, you know, we, we sort of morphed to our, you know, our, our, our smallest boat is 42 feet and um, you know, we're looking at doing new 38 footer. We, we, we need to get entry level products. So that is important for big picture, you know, yeah. strategy as uh, getting people into the brand as early as you can. So that's obviously important. But yeah, we just sold our first Palm Beach 101, so which is really exciting and uh, to a Florida, Floridian you know, couple and um, very, very excited about that project. And uh, so that's, you know, that's a whole new sort of dimension for us. We already currently in build with our two Palm Beach 85s. So we're going to a, a, a bigger level again, and um, that's very exciting as well. And once again, all based around performance, efficiency, and uh, a whole new world for, for that size of boat in, in the industry. So I think, um, yeah, it'll be something really cool to, to, to watch and see what happens. And you're under, the, as you mentioned, the same roof as another legendary uh, brand in Grand Banks. I sold my company, Palm Beach Media, to Grand Banks 10 years ago. It's amazing how quickly that's gone, but, um, you know, another iconic brand, obviously thousands of boats around the world. And um, it's been a real honor to sort of take that whole program on. Um, the company was struggling for many years there and you know, we took it over and we've turned it around to a, a completely different business today and new product and um, you know, focus on the same sort of parameters of you know, efficiency, long range cruising at higher speeds. And uh, it's working very well for us. And I think um, you're going to see some great things out of Grand Banks over the next few years. In our Australia's Classic Boats project, we've spoken to a few of the old Helveson stalwarts. Do you sort of feel as though that Palm Beach has sort of picked up where Helveson has left off 
Uh, do you get a sense of that, that you're sort of a modern classic? Very nice thing to have been said. But And, and look, yeah, I mean, Halverson's an iconic brand as well. And the guys were same deal, very revolutionary in those days, right? And, and, and it was a big deal. Um, and they're very successful and still are, to, you know, the, the brand's still iconic today. So, but yeah, look, it's, I don't even think about that stuff. It's just happening naturally. And um, we've built, you know, hundreds of boats uh, to date and um, we're going to keep going, you know? And so it is what it is. I guess you just, you know, create a bit of your own history and that's definitely what's happening with, that, with our brand. And um, yeah, once again, it's a lot of fun and yeah, let's see where it goes.